हे एवरी वन आय एम आर सुशित एंड वी आर वॉचिंग कनेक्ट एक आयुष इंग्लिश प्लस सब्सक्राइब लाइक एंड शेयर माई चैनल सो आई विल बी मोटिवेटेड फॉर क्रिएटिंग टेक्निकल यूज लैंग्वेज सो आई स्टार्टेड टू डिवर कटेडिंग और फुल स्टार्ट फॉर डेवलपमेंट सीरीज एंड दिस इज और पार्ट थर्टी एट एंड इन दिस सीरियो वे आर गोइंग टू रिस्कट अ प्रोजेक्ट एंड दैट इज पोर्ट फॉल यू सो लेट्स गो टू आर कंप्यूटर स्क्रीन एंड गेट स्टार्टेड सो हियर आई टू बेसिकली क्रिएटेड अ बेसिक नाव पार फॉर यू एंड अ बेसिक स्टाइल शीट सो इट्स लाइक दिस राइट नो but we will firstly design the nav bar so i am writing this display to flex now let me tell you what is cross axis and what is just main axis now the cross axis is that thing suppose your flex direction is rho then the cross axis will be opposite of that and that will be column and if flex your flex direction is column then your cross axis will be rho and if your now main axis is that thing that that is equal to your flex direction suppose your flex direction is rho then your main axis will be rho and if your flex direction is column then your then your main direction will be also column uh, so we have a property called justify item it is used to set the it is used to set the main axis so i am writing the main axis to between space between and so if this and go here uh, it's like this After that, we are using nested CLS, nested CSS, and we are writing U L and list style type none. Save this and go here. Refresh. Now it's like this. Display flex. and the li have the margin of margin right of 10 pixels or we can specify that as 1 rem so let's go here refresh it's like this and now after that we have a and we are specifying the a as uh as text decoration none if this and go here refresh we have height as 100 100% save this and go here refresh then we are assigning its align items to the center so let's go here refresh so it's like this now we are applying a effect on it and from now watch the video very carefully so i am writing here when when here is the after effect after means if we write it content to a then it will automatically display a after a each and every a element So I am assigning it width to hundred percent right now, and border bottom to one pixel solid four AF EFF. Save this and go here. Refresh. And we can assign it just. like this and here the position as absolute then left to 0 pixel then left to 0 top to 100 percent shift this and refresh right now we have that and what if we then it like 50% then let's see it is working so we are assigning this to be 0% and see if this and go here now nothing will happen so i am writing that 
if someone hover or after then change this thing this works 200 percent save this and refresh Uh, save this refresh now it's working but now we want a transition so we are writing it like this transition all one second linear semicolon save this go here refresh yeah it's looking good so after that you can create your portfolio as well as you want so i am just creating two sections here we are creating a section here we have a h1 for home and a paragraph about yourself about me here after that you have to write a section Here you can pass iframe src is equal to now iframe is a service in HTML that allows you to inject a inject a page in your inner HTML. So we can use it like this. So it's loading. So this is the URL. We can just simply paste that. So now it's working. Now you can do many things in it. I know this is not good portfolio, but this is for your basic understanding for HTML and CSS.